Hey, what's going on, guys? I'd like to thank y'all for tuning in with me, John and Jay, once again for another Let's Talk Stock video. I have uh, like five or six stocks I want to go over with you guys. Three other stocks I'm currently in already. Two of them are ones that I want to take a position in if the price meets the price that I want to buy in at. Uh, I hope you guys have been having a great weekend in the market. It's been pretty good, pretty up and down for me. Also, if you guys don't mind, y'all can like and subscribe to the video. I do have links to my accounts down below if you guys want to grab some free stocks from Webull or from Robinhood. So if, like I said, if you guys don't mind, give this video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, also hit the bell just in case whenever I post a video, you will get an alert for that. All right, now with all that being said, let's go ahead and get into my portfolio so I can show you all how I'm looking in certain stocks. All right, guys, now that we're in my portfolio, as you see, I'm currently sitting at $5,449.16. Today was a pretty flat day for me. I went up, well, I came in up, I went down, went back up, went back down. So just fluctuated right around the same mark for me kind of all day. Now, a few stocks I want to talk to you guys about. Uh, I'm in three of these already. Uh, two of them I'm considering entering. So the first one we're going to do is talk about plug power. Ticker symbol PLUG. All right, now I currently have shares of this stock right here. I'm sitting at roughly 10, a little bit over 10 and a half, almost 11 shares with a market value of $736. All right, right now it's currently sitting at $68.75. Pretty good day today. Now it did hit a 52 week high a few, uh, once a week or two ago at uh, $75.49. Uh, let's go back to January the 26th. It was right up in here. Now it has taken a few drops, but uh, that's nothing the best thing you should do is buy dips that's why i always encourage to buy dips i did grab i think two more shares um, earlier this week because uh, i'm pretty sure that this stock will get back to its 82 week high and then just go on to the moon from there another stock i want to go over you guys with is ticker symbol z-o-m stock right here to this 52 we have today as well which is which was a dollar and fifty right now it's currently sitting there a dollar and forty seven cents like I said guys this why it's always important to buy the dips 117 early this morning and over the week um I think it was under a dollar yeah so now I did hit a dollar a few weeks back as well Around January the 12th so if you guys would have bought a few of these dips when it was below 90 cents uh, you'll be even you'll be even in a better position than you are now now we are still holding this stock right here to the after March now right after March I'm going to take all my profit then I'm just gonna play with the house money on this one it honestly depends on how much it runs up so I know my average cost right now is 92 cents and I'm already right at a total return of like 58%. So that's pretty good. I said once it, uh, right after March, once it does what it do, I'm going to take all my money I put in out and I'm just going to play with the profit. So let's go over another one, Naked Brand, N-A-K-D. Now this stock right here guys has been going up and down it i thought it was honestly gonna keep going up it opened the market up this morning pretty good and it just went down from there now last week or earlier this week it did take big dips down 76 cents now if you guys would have grabbed some of that uh, if you guys would have grabbed some shares of that while i was at 76 77 cents uh, you would have doubled your money today I did think it got up to like a dollar and forty cents closely to a dollar and forty five cents so you would have doubled some of what you put in when you bought in at the 70 75 76 cents uh, that it was at uh, 
yesterday or the day before yesterday. Now, two stocks that uh, I'm considering getting in. I'm going to go to search. The first one is TNXP. I actually got put on to this one by a person that commented under one of my under my previous video that I uploaded to YouTube. And I think it got up to $1.40, $1.50 this morning. So I did not buy into it. I went on a pullback. So in the morning, if this right here is anywhere at $1.15 under, I will be grabbing some shares. I'm not just gonna go all the way in, I'm gonna nibble at it just in case it does continue to drop. Like I said, it's best to I'm trying to average down my uh, average cost. Let's get to we high at two dollars and forty six cents. But like I said, in the morning once this stock, once the stock market opens, if it's at a dollar fifteen or under, I will be buying shares of this stock. And the other one is OG Ewen. Anywhere under a dollar, I will be buying in this one right here as well. I'm going to get me a good position. Uh, maybe at least start off with maybe 100, 200 shares just to start off. Now this 52 week high is two dollars and nine cents, which kind of would double from here. If we buy in right here, right now, a dollar and one cent. So pretty much double if it get back to its 52, 52 week high. So okay, those are the two plays that I'm going to get in tomorrow. TEN XP and the other one is OG EN. Hey, I really want to thank you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed watching the video. Hope you guys learned a lot, got some information on a few stocks. Also, if you guys have been with me, you guys know we've been in Jamaica for, I was in it like 52 cents, 53 cents. And I, right now, like I said earlier today, it did hit a high of a dollar and 50 cents. So it's kind of tripled your money right there. And I did take profit every time uh, it hit 100%. I'll take a little bit, buy back in, take a little bit, buy back in. But at the same time, like I said, I hope you guys were uh, doing the same. It's always good to take a little profit. Uh, either you want to just have it for yourself or if you want to take some profit and put it in another stock. So you don't have to keep putting in your money and buying other stocks. So you can take profit that way. It's kind of like paying yourself. So that's the way I'm looking at it. And the naked brand, guys, we're still trying to hold that one out. If it hits under a dollar, make sure you guys buy more shares of it. You don't want to get left out. It's, it might give you one more time to buy in or get more shares under a dollar, but if, who, who's to say? So it'd be pretty tough. So if it does go under a dollar, make sure you try to grab you some more shares of that. I know I will. And a few stocks that the other two stocks that we're trying to get positions in. If they happen to go below the price that you bought in at first, try to average down and buy more once it drops. So, and uh, OGEN, if you buy it at 99 cents, if something happened to drop to 90 cents, grab some shares of that while it's 90 cents so you can uh, bring down your average cost. That's always a good thing to bring down your average cost. If any stock that you are in goes down under your average cost, Make sure you buy some stocks. I mean, make sure you buy some shares of that stock. Always try to uh, buy less than what you bought in it. And with that being said, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Like I said, also, I'm pretty sure I said it before, but I'm going to say it again. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to the video. Also, hit the bell for the notifications so when I post a video, you'll get a notification for it. You'll be able to watch it right then as soon as I upload it. Also, guys, y'all, that's it. I mean, that's it on my end. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Continue making money. Until next time.